So in this video, you'll learn how to use the built-in compass on your Samsung Galaxy S25. So the first step is to open the settings app and in settings, you want to scroll and select the option display. Under display, look for edge panels and tap on it. And then you want to ensure that the edge panels feature is enabled. Once it's enabled, you then want to come to the option panels and select it. Then under panels, you look for the one labeled tools. So you should see it right here and the preview is even a compass. So you want to just select that so that it's added to the edge panels section. Once it's selected, you can now exit the settings app. So from here, if you ever want to access the built-in compass, you have to start by swiping on the edge panel to bring it up. And then when you see the list of shortcuts available, just swipe again and you should see the tools section. And from here, the first tool that you're able to access is the compass. So in order for you to, able to be able to use this compass feature, you have to start by setting it up. Doing that, it's fairly simple. Just tap on next and allow it to access your location data. And then you want to tap on calibrate and you just want to move your phone around so that your phone can get used to your movements and motions. And then once you've done that, you can see the compass is now functional. You can even see at the bottom, it gives you the location as well as the longitude and the latitude of your current, wherever you are currently. So if you move, then this should change. And so that's how you can use the built-in compass on your Galaxy S25. Thank you for watching. If you have any questions or comments, leave them down below and we'll get back to you.